Hi everyone, it's Gail. I am here with a couple of Happy Mails today. This first one is from Anita and I'm just gonna kind of get everything out of the sack here. Oops. I've torn the sack, but that's okay. I'm still gonna use this for little collage paper. Okay, so Anita sent this cute bunny card and she wrote her letter so that I could still use the bunny card. That was so nice. <laughs> um, yeah, so let's get started looking. Let's start here. So she said in her card that she hoped I got this quick enough to use these these um, cards in my circus journals, which I haven't gotten back to working on those four that are going to be in my shop. So she's just in time. So look at these fun cards. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love that one. That's really cool. Just all sorts of vintage cards. Love them. Some cardinals. Ooh, that's a fun one with the seed pack. Wow. These are other seed packs. I just love all the different playing cards that you can find. They're just so fun. Look at those little birdies. And those. Ooh, that's a pretty one. And got a hummingbird on this one. Really fun. Thank you, Anita. Oh, look at the bunny cards. Yay. <laughs> and little squirrels, whoops. And raccoons. And kitty cats. Oh, thank you, Anita. Yes, I will use all of those. Thank you so much. I really like them. And this string is awesome, too, for a circus journal. It's really colorful. So that's super fun. Thank you. And she sent this little bunny stamp. And then she's got all tied up in this cool yarn. She says about this book, this little guy wouldn't leave, let me leave him in the thrift store. I don't know if you can do anything with him, but if anyone can, it's you. Bunny Rabbit's story. Oh my gosh, this, yep, it's, it's seen better days, hasn't it? Oh my goodness. There's some cute, cute little images in there though. Look at that. That's cute. So... Yeah, I think, I think something, oh, look at that. That's really cool. Oh my gosh, yes, yeah, something can be done with him. He just needs a, he needs a little love. I love the, love the um, cover. Yeah, thank you so much, Anita, thank you. Oh, and we've got a couple golden books here. Home for a Bunny and the Bunny Book, yay. Oh. Did you mean to send these two? Oh, these are these are like vintage postcards, all Valentine. Now, Anita, if you didn't mean to send those to me, let me know when I can send them back to you because they were inside Home for a Bunny. They're awesome, but I want to make sure that you meant to send them. <laughs> those are really cool. Those are really cool. I will set those aside until I hear from you, Anita. I'll try and remember to message you too. So Home for Bunny, the bunny book, and <laughs> Leo the Lop. Oh my goodness, look at that bunny. Isn't he cute? Oh my gosh, this, oh my goodness, look at him. So cute. Oh, those illustrations are wonderful. Oh, look at that. Thank you, Anita. Look at the owl. 
That is really so beautiful. Look at him. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh. That is a cute little book. That is super cute. Thank you, Anita. Those are awesome. Okay, and then she's she's got a little package of trims in here. Whole bunch of them. Cheesy peasy. So I'll show you the patterns up close. It's just um it's fabric fabric trim, creative craft and floral ribbons, it says on there. Very cool. This little lacy one. And then that one. Oh, thank you. Those are really fun, Anita. I'll have fun with those, no doubt. Oh my goodness, and then put those in there, and then she has all kinds of lace. She says, watch for pins. Oh my goodness, so I'll, and she's got these beautifully put on these cute little cards, I'm trying to get them out without taking the lace. Oh, that one came right off. <laughs> That's all right. I'll, I'll get that back on, but I think I just needed to get a start on this bag here. Okay. Alrighty. So a couple of yarns, a couple of yarns. Look at how cute she made these with the little corner punch. Oh, that's a beautiful lace. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Look at the pretty pin she used, too. Love that. Oh, my gosh. This has got a little gold sparkle in it. So pretty. You see? See how pretty that is? Just delicate. Here's some kind of um, more like crocheted trim. If I put my fingers under it. Of course, I'll hit the camera. Oh, this is pretty. Can you see that? It's shiny yellow and gold, kind of. So pretty. Oh, this is so cute. Let's see. Maybe you got like that. Um, there's some eyelet lace. And this, oops, I'm so sorry. I'm trying to get it close to you and I keep hitting the camera. Um, this place, let's see if I can get under there to show ya. Oh gosh, thank you, Anita. This little tiny, this looks very vintage, this lace. Look at that, isn't that beautiful? And this lace, so pretty. Ooh, this is interesting. Look at the look at the little bumps on it. Isn't that kind of cool? And this one, so pretty, so pretty. Ooh, and this is a beautiful embroidered with a ribbon through it. That's really pretty. And then this one that came off of the roll. <laughs> there we go. Oh, thank you, Anita. That is a batch of lovely, lovely lace. And then the last thing in her in her bag here is some doilies. Oh wow, these are these are lovely. Gosh, you can always use the doilies, right? couple of those and this one and this one. Ooh, look at that. That's tatting. That's gorgeous. 
it's gorgeous. Love the tatting. And there's a couple of those. Then this one. Then this beautiful lace. And this, well, this one. Thank you so much, Anita. Oh, that's lots of fun goodies. Thank you. Yes, I'll be using those clown cards right away, too. <laughs> So thank you so much. And then a second one came from Sonia. So I'm going to, let's see. Got it down here on the floor so that I can try and keep from showing you the address. Okay, so I'm just going to pull stuff out of here. <laughs> and we'll just go through it together. I haven't haven't gone through this one other than to look at the card so oh my goodness there is stuff and stuff and stuff in here you guys okay I'm just gonna get it out because I don't want to keep reaching to the floor um, my back is better but let's let's not push it right so oh my goodness Wowzers okay. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, Sonia. Okay. Um, just about there. Just about there, guys. <laughs> um, okay. Probably jumbled this up somewhat, but uh, I'm going to just do my best here to get it out. Okay. Okay. There we go. Got it. Okay, let's look at the card first. She made this card. Isn't this wonderful? And look, she made a little altered paper clip that says Gail. How fun is that? And then she wrote a wonderful, um, a wonderful letter on coffee dyed paper. So crunchy and wonderful. So that was really fun. Um and she just appreciates my videos. And she also talked about, I think she, she says, I don't make junk journals, but you've inspired me to try some of your techniques. She mostly does mixed media. Well, you make a mean card too, Sonia. <laughs> so yeah. That is beautiful. Thank you for that. Okay, let's, let's put these aside a little bit. And she talked in her letter about some tags and things she made. So I'm excited to see. Oh my, isn't that pretty? Yeah, she does do mixed media. Very fun. Okay, so she's just she's got some things wrapped up in here so be wonderful that one's wonderful too and oh look at this life is beautiful she's just really layered everything so nicely capable of amazing things oh i love that and then she's got a little cluster a little cluster happening so those are lovely and look at the paper that she wrapped them in i'm sure she's stamped that or something that is really cool i'm gonna be using that paper too <laughs> that's really fun gosh thank you sonia let me set these aside kind of and then we'll look in this one. Oh wow love these I'm pretty sure this one is an altered merchandise tag I had one of my very first uh, videos was on altering you know packaging tags the artist's vocation is to send light into the human heart oh that's beautiful thank you Sonia 
I feel like there's enough for me to put in my in my regular journals and and do a page in my um, Junctional Friends journals. This is a an envelope. My happy place. That's what I call my craft room. I love it. Enjoy the little things. That's beautiful. That is beautiful. And then this one. Oh, this is gorgeous. So inspire up here. Look at this old book. And all layered up with washi and pearls and fibers and lace. And then the back. She's got a pocket and yet another tag, which I believe is supposed to come out. Hang on. Yep. Just was a little sticky. And then, oh, and it says Gail. That's so awesome. Thank you so much, Sonia. These are great. Yep. I need to do a, need to do a page in my friend's junk journal for sure. I might keep this paper to kind of put on the back of that. Oh, that's wonderful. Okay, and then she sent, oh my goodness, all sorts of goodies. I don't even know where to start. Let's start over here with napkins. <laughs> Always a good place to start. So she sent all kinds of napkins. So there's this one. There's some sunflowers. There's butterflies. There's some um, foil dots. And then on the other side, it's plain. Holidays. A couple of different holiday ones. So. Christmas tree and then happy holidays. Love it. And then these bigger ones, these, these feel so cool. They're like, they're embossed. Can you see that? And they're um, silver. That I love that embossing. That's going to be fun to play with. And then this one, with pretty border. And then, oh, this beautiful, looks like there might be different images on there are different leaf images on each quarter of the napkin oh thank you Sonia those are fabulous really fun okay so that's that's the napkin stack she sent some distress ink I think she might have said she had two of these and so she didn't want this to, you know, to uh, dry up. So she thought I could use that. She's got some sticker dots, colorful sticker dots. Um, ooh, some fibers. Oh, look at those. Those are yummy. And then some green and red. Maybe put that with my Christmas stuff, the green and red. Really fun. Oh my goodness, all sorts of washi tapes. Those are super fun, thank you. Let's see if I can put these sideways up here so you can kind of see. On the one um, tag she used this, you are capable of amazing things. Oh, that's really fun, thank you. Okay, and then there was a batch of baker's twine really fun these are colors that i do not have so i love those those are so fun so baker's twine and then also some embroider embroidery floss that is all different colors how fun is that um let's see some blue burlap really cool i can so tell you're mixed media and artist my friend just all sorts of fun stuff this pink kind of like burlap ribbon and 
some little lace and this ribbon that's corrugated. Those are fun. Okay, and then this is interesting. It's kind of like feltish. It's feltish, and she used it on, let me find the tag that she used it on. See, she used it on this tag. Do you see that? Really cool, really cool. Oh my gosh, so fun. And she sent a palette. Gosh, you can never have too many of those, can ya? And then here she has some thick lace. Oh my gosh, that's fun. That'll be make a fun pocket, won't it? So that, and then some butterfly fabric. And then this stuff. I don't know what you call it. Mesh, I guess. Interesting. Yes, I'm not I'm not exactly sure what to do with that, but I bet you I find a find something. It seems like it'd be fun under layers. Okay, and in here she's got some cording, some fall leaves, a little a little ribbon flower kind of thing, and a couple of charms. Let's see. A couple of doggies and a Christmas charm. Fun, thank you. Okay, and then, then and then, <laughs> I've got a big pile over here. There's um, a baggie of these small shells that I'm sure you could use as beads. Those are cool. Look at the, all of those. And then in this little thing, I think she's got some beads that she made. Oh, wow. You guys, look at these beads. Let me get them up to you. Aren't those cool? Yeah, she's made all those. Those are going to be super fun for a boho journal. Look at that. Just fun. Thank you so much, Sonia. There's a lot of work represented in this little tin or little plastic thing. <coughs> Excuse me. I knew it was coming. Glue dots. Awesome. And then I think some paper things. So let's go through these. These look like... Oh, they're all sorts of botanical pages and they're, they're like stained and wonderful. Oh my gosh. Those are fabulous. Love those. Love those. Thank you. Those will be definitely put to good use. This is a stack of envelopes. And are these envelopes too? Nope. These are papers colorful papers and envelopes and then the cards that go in the envelopes. Awesome. Some lavender envelopes that look like this C postcard might go inside. Yep. Yep. And then there's also some stationery that goes with that. Those are beautiful. Thank you. Some postcards of, I think these are of old paintings. Yeah. Daphne's Diary. I totally recognize it. Some fun little envelope, framey envelope type of things. Trustworthy positive. <laughs> the kitty cat is stubborn. I love it. Those are fun. Oh, fun. Look at this yummy paper that she's done. 
Oh, you make when you want to pop back to my mixed media self, Sonia. She's got a bunch of doilies, all different sizes. Those are so fun. Oh my gosh, and painty papers. Oh, I love them, love them, love them, love them. I love painty papers. They're so much fun. Look at those. Those are fabulous. Love them, love them, love them, love them. It looks like she's done some stamping on this, um, this old dictionary paper, which is lovely. Look at that. Ooh. I want to make a journaling card or tag out of that as we speak. Love it. Some coffee dyed papers. Those are wonderful. Yes. Just coffee dyed yumminess. Thank you so much. Look at these old ledger sheets. These are great. So she's got some coffee dyed ones on top and then some that aren't coffee dyed. Oh, I love those. Thank you so much, Sonia. And fabulous thin coffee dyed. Can you hear that? <laughs> Is that not awesome? Oh, and here's some more pages of it that I can copy that myself. Awesome. And I will. Oh, that's so fun. Here's some Christmas stationery or winter stationery, really. That's fun. I could use some of that in my um this one is faded. See how it's blue instead of green? But that might work in my A Winter's Tale journal. Some maps, always good. Oh, look at here. We've got A Winter's Tale. She's got it all clipped for me. A Winter's Tale. She's got... Oh, yes. Fun. Those are fun. Daphne's diary things cannot be used in journals for sale, though. So I'll have to save those for my glue book or something. I didn't know if you guys all knew that, but it's true. But she's got some other stuff on the back here. Oh, fun. I do this too, Sonia. I tear apart the envelopes and keep the bits. Oh, those are wonderful. Thank you. I can use everything but the Daphne's diary. I could use that in something that I keep, but, or give away. A rabbit. Oh, yes. This could be used in my, um, in my bunny journal. Oh, and some circus stuff. Fun. Oh, that's fun. Oh, it's a pencil case. You can make it into a pencil case. Love it. Look at how bright and happy those colors are. <laughs> oh, and farm. She just has me all figured out. You all kind of do, don't you? Oh, so farm. Oh, that's so cool. Let's just unclip here so that cause this one's kind of fat. Okay, so we've got farm. We've got some postcards that are farm type got horses and pigs <laughs> oh and look at these wonderful corn images those are fun oh that's awesome yes so cool I like how she's just torn out the image got it coffee dyed sometimes I feel like I'm drowning in paper, but I think it's because I haven't done that sort of thing. Made them smaller and more manageable. Oh, yes. These are great. Thank you. The dictionary page. Oh, look at this paper. That's awesome. Jeans paper. Perfect. So great for a, a farm journal. 
Oh my gosh. Thank you, Sonia. Thank you, Anita. What beautiful happy meals. You guys are just amazing. And I appreciate your thinking of me and your generosity. It's just, it's amazing. So thank you so much and thank you everyone for watching and we will just see you in the next video. Thanks everyone. Bye-bye.